Not to a car. Hey, yo, I'm eating fun dip right now. Not giving a fuck. Well, I'm a magical unicorn. <clears throat> Hold on. I need to kill Chrome so that it doesn't make my game lag. So I'm loving this game, but I kind of want to get this game done faster than I was because I also want to play Undertale. And I refuse to play another game until I finish this one. But that is the plan. After this, it's Undertale. Alright, computer. Why are you still lagging? Look. Small desktop. That. Oh, hold on. I'll switch over the uh, the screen in a second. I just want to make sure this works. There we go. There we go. drivers for my microphone. I mean, I've had it for a while and I haven't updated the drivers in a long time. It hurts my face. I don't know if I need to redo some of the events. Because I don't think I left the game at a safe point. Despite the flaws of yourself. Thank you. <laughs> Pretty soon, I will be getting rid of the little um, game icon gif that I have in the right corner. Because I will be using webcam. No, it's nothing you need to concern yourself with. I don't think so. <coughs> Please don't it. Hold on. Sheriff, is there something more I can help you with? You decided you want to taste of the wares? Oh, I see. Come to audition, you bitch. Smack. Where's Crane? Ichabod Crane? What would that nerd have with a place like this? Just go in there. We have a problem. Tell me who did it. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. Mr. Crane, please. She can't help. I 
know you know what the plan is. I won't be held accountable for this. Oh my god, Bigby! Wait, don't! I, I, I didn't do anything, I promise you, I didn't do anything! These girls, the, the girls, they'll back me up. I j just have to get the stupid ring working, that's all. They can't talk because of that spell, but once this ring gets through, I'll know what's going on and this whole thing will be over. That's all, please. I'm innocent, completely, completely innocent. The ring won't work. Greenleaf sold you out. What? No. This will work. I assure you, it, it must. I, I wouldn't stick you. Damn you. Come on. Please. Tell me who killed her. My lips are sealed. What? How many years has this been going on? Too... Too many. But I didn't kill those women, Bigby. Please, I had nothing, nothing to do with that. I just... I... It just... Oh, God! We found the photos of you and Lily. I know, I know. That's... That was... I just... I just love you, Snow. I love, I love you, and, and I'm sorry I'm not Prince Charming, okay? I'm sorry I didn't cheat on you and run away to Europe. You don't love me, Crane. I know what this is. I've seen it before. It is not love. Bigby? I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? He's not... He wouldn't be brave enough. What do you mean? You don't think he did it at all? If you'd seen the room... I don't need to see the room. There's a lot he has to answer for. There's a lot we all have to answer for. This is different, Snow, and you know it. You said you found evidence of him defrauding Fabletown. Of using our money for his own ambitions. That's one thing. But don't you have doubts he's a murderer? We've both known him for so long. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Did you see how he was acting when you showed up? Yes, I know how this... This fuck-up knows more than he's saying. I don't. I don't! Uh, yes, okay, he probably does. But there's a difference between being involved and being the guy who did it. Okay, but if Crane didn't kill Faith and Lily, I'm sorry, but who the hell did? This whole thing is bigger than Crane. You wouldn't have the stones to send the Tweedles after me. Somebody else is involved. Well, shit. I didn't intend for any of this to get so- You've been stealing money from Fabletown for years, haven't you? Yeah. We're not gonna kill you. So quit your shivering. Ichabod Crane, you are under arrest for the misappropriation of Fabletown funds. You have the right to counsel, the right to depose witnesses. But as of right now, you're coming with us. You are extraordinarily lucky Miss White was here to save your ass. Because if it was up to me, you'd have your head swinging from the Washington Bridge. Okay, Sheriff, that's enough. This can't be Greenleaf again and again, behaving however you like, acting without constraint. You have to respect this office, Bigby. And you have to respect me as its leader, starting now. You think you have what it takes to run that office? You think I didn't make sacrifices? I made sacrifices. And you won't be in that chair one minute before you have to give up something you care about just so the wheels don't fall off the goddamn wagon. I did the best I could with what I had. And the town took everything it could out of me. If I maybe took a little something back in return? Yeah, see, the thing of it is, we're better at this than you are.
preposterous schemes. What are you saying? It's recently come under our attention that you're, how shall I put this, attempting to claim what is the personal property of the Crooked Man. He's about yay high, 120 odd pounds, kissed his sheets until he was 14. Sound familiar? I haven't told him anything. Not now, not now. Shh. The grown-ups are talking. Who are you? No, 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 no. That's not how this works. How this works is you are going to walk Crane over here, like a good doggy. It wasn't my fault. <clears throat> Shut up. You're interfering with official Fabletown business. Step aside. Tweedledee, what's the, uh, you know, that thing the Mundies call me? Wh what? My nickname. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, Bloody, bloody Ma Mary. That's it. Thank you. And do you know why they call me that? Because some of them, they think it's funny to have their little sleepovers and go into their little bathrooms and say my name five times in the mirror. They find it less funny when I actually show up and feed their lungs to the family dog. And I do that for a hobby. Like golf, to relax. This was really the wrong day to try and pull this shit. I told you he'd never just give him up. Fuck it. Super Saiyan now. Better watch out. My hair's gonna go all spiky.
Oh, that's a different kind of bullet. Oh, God, it was a good show, but, you know, I just didn't know when to end. your lucky day, kid. The crooked man says it's okay with him. Hello, Ichabod. Got a stomachache? Oh, and just between us girls? Crane ain't no kill. I mean, look at his face. Couldn't stick a pig if his life depended. Yeah, I kind of feel kind of like your boyfriend here. Her. Too pussy to ruin a twins day. <laughs> well, this is gonna be a beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really, I mean it. I'm jazzed about it. Out with the old, in with the new. Long live the queen. I'm sure we'll be in touch. See you around. He's lucky to be alive, and he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. This is getting worse by the minute. We don't have time to sit around and wait for their next move. I'll get things under control. Woody, I'm not gonna tell you again. Back off, dog. This doesn't concern you. What do you want to talk about? I just wanted to, um, about last night. After what they did to you, are you even going to be able to stop them? Don't hold out on me, Jack. You've always got some angle. Not this time. I know when a mark's not worth the trouble. Do you? Don't make me come down there to deal with you. I don't want it. You don't want it. <laughs> then again, you don't have much choice at this point. Do you? And my connection is losing its mind, so we're going to wait a minute till it stabilizes. <clears throat>
device that's connected to the internet right now that should not be because that might be what's messy with my connection. I have way too many draw frames for my uh, for my liking right now. Okay, so I found something that was on, and uh, let me turn up my microphone a little bit. Maybe it's too low. Okay, let's see. Let's see how that works. <clears throat> what do we have in the extras? Book of Fables. I always like the Book of Fables. It looks like there's two things here that I didn't unlock in the first one. I might have to go back and play through it on my own time and get that. <clears throat> oh, didn't mean to do that. Now you hear white noise. God dang it. Curses! <laughs> Alright. I turned it down a little bit. <laughs> I need to, um, I need to get a pop filter. And, um, I heard there's a program that I can get. That'll help me with my audio. Ugh, I just don't know what I'm doing as far as audio, so I'm just winging it, but, you know, maybe, maybe it'll be good for me to learn something new. Okay, who's Vivian? I think we've got two left. Um, there's five chapters in this game, so let's see. Yep, there's five. All right. So we're gonna start episode four. I'm excited. This keeps getting more and more complicated, but I love it.
can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I can't finish the mirror. It's missing a piece. Crane must have taken a shot and... The open arms. Enjoy your stay. Thanks, Bigby. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. Bigby? How could you do this to me? I guess I finally see you for who you are! Tell me who did it! Just tell me who did it! I know you know! I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? Bullets are a nasty business. The silver slug deformed and shredded on impact. He'll be okay, though. Hmm? He'll be okay? His internal organs are positively riddled. If I don't extract every single scrap of silver, he's liable to suffer some long-term toxicosis. Easy there. Try not to move. We can't keep needing this way, old boy. I figured I'd be done before you were conscious, but there's little I can do for the pain. Just stay still and let me finish. What... <clears throat> what happened to me? There was... You got lucky, and found yourself in the care of a most skillful surgeon. Me. <clears throat> Please, Big B, don't move it. Doctor. Look, I'm a bit engaged saving his life at the moment. But if the fractured extremity concerns him that much, he can set it himself. Oh dear. Okay. Okay, we're gonna set the fracture. Oh dear. Why do I have to keep doing this? do I suppose he's lucky to be alive and he won't be next time if he keeps going like this he didn't listen to me before maybe he'll listen to you I don't know about that well he should there are limits to what even I can do you know I can't hear you quiet just relax <laughs> easy to say when you got somebody jabbing inside you Excuse me, Miss White, but perhaps it'd be better if you gave me a few minutes to finish with him. I, I think I should stay, at least until he's out of the woods. Believe me, Bigby couldn't be in better hands, and I need the space to work, so... Don't worry, Snow. I'll be okay. I want to know when they're gonna moment. kiss. Just please, give us the time. <laughs> That'll be a good time, Snow. <laughs> Hey, Doc, how much longer? Colin, leave.
leave him be. It's finished when it's finished. Because I once watched a vet sew a turtle together in ten minutes flat. Colin, you're not even supposed to be here right now. Oh, really? Where am I supposed to be? Could you please not distract the doctor while he has my chest cut open? Yes, that would be helpful. <sighs> there. All done. Great. This isn't a habit you should keep to. Having visits with me. And, well, this time... That was fast. This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. <laughs>